Today I'm going to tie for you guys the clinger nymph. To tie the clinger nymph I will use a size 12 or size 14 scut size hook like a TMC 2487 and then I'll add to this one, this is a size 12 hook, I will add a 1 8 tungsten bead that's copper color. Following that, add the thread. All the way to the back, and I will go roughly to where the barb used to be. Next thing I will add is 0 0.03 thread, oh, sorry, 0 0.03 lead wire um, because this fly has to be a fish, this fly in very fast water. I want to make sure it sinks quickly. So in addition to the tungsten bead, I'll also add a few wraps of a few wraps of um, that wire. Not too many because I want to make a an abdomen as well. Cut the excess off. That's what we have there. Then I will use for the tail of this nymph um, some black crystal flash. And for the clinger nymph, in the case the clinger mayflies, you can either do two tails or three tails. But the vast majority of clinger nymphs have three tails. <coughs> Does it really matter to the fish? Your fish catching ability? Probably not. But I like to add three tails. So I will add into the fly. To the back. I will later on I will cut them shorter. Next I will also add some small um, brown copper wire. I will use the brown copper wire for a ribbing later on to help make it to fly last longer. At this point also I will start to taper the body towards the thorax. So the half second part, half second half here it will be the abdomen, the front half where you see the lead wire will be the thorax. So I'm going to make a taper there for a smooth transition. I will also put some Of the wire, so we so saw some of the thread on the thorax too. Once we've done that, that should be good. All the way, to, all the way to the back. Now for the body, and this may be a surprise a lot of people. I will use blood leech Arizona semi seal. I use blood leech because if you look at a lot of clinger nymphs, they have a brownish reddish color to it, and when you use this blood leech dubbing. When you put it in the water, it sort of adopts that reddish brownish color, what I like for a clinger nymph. So that's why I would use this color. Not a typical color dubbing for leech, uh, sorry for um, clinger nymphs, but it works great. And I will sort of start from the back. Work my way forward. Now there's a few extra wires, but what I often do is I will just give it a bit of a haircut. I don't mind if there's a few sticking out, I like the buggy look, but not too buggy. Next I will take my copper wire, I wrap my dubbing around this way, so my copper wire, wire will go the opposite way. Just evenly spaced towards the thorax.
Type it in. Um, I use fire orange thread for this fly because it generates a nice little hot spot at the end when I'm done. So there's the abdomen. Now, next for the wing case of the um, fly, I use black holographic tinsel. Secure it at the right on top of the thorax area. Now, to build up the thorax, I will again use the same dubbing as for the abdomen. I don't want to see you. Thorax. Next, I will tie in a few legs and I will again take three strands of um, black crystal flash for this. And I use only three pieces, they will just tie on both ends so to minimize the number of tying steps. So again, I will tie it in on. Up there, two wraps this way, two wraps that way, into the place, one more wrap this way, one more wrap that way. I'll push them down. Next, after this, I will take my um, wing case of black holographic tinsel, tie it down. Three wraps. Now to keep it in place, I will also fold this back. Two wraps. And then I will whip finish this fly. Cut the thread off. Yeah, I can cut the remainder of the tinsel off cut the legs short and to, to judge the legs length I will pull back and cut it right to where the abdomen ends same on the other side pull on the legs gently pull them back to where the abdomen ends and then these three tails I will gently pull forward and cut them to where the bead ends. And there is my clinger knife. Just pull the legs, or the, rather the tails, into position again. And there is the clinger knife. Great little fly to use in ruffles and runs using the indicator method, high sticking or any Euro method, Euro fishing, nothing.